What's up guys, it's Federer with 3D Print SOS. Today, I wanna to cover two questions that I get a lot, and that's, what's my favorite filament, and what filament do I recommend you guys buy? So I wanna answer those, and I wanna unbox two boxes of my favorite current filament, go over what's in there, and give you some suggestions. All right, let's head over there. All right guys, so let's start with the first question, and that's, what filament would I suggest you buy? And I'm going to say this repeatedly, especially if you're brand new or looking to just get a bunch of prints out, and, this, and that's go on Amazon, get yourself the cheapest filament that you can find regardless of the brand. Typically you can get a roll for around 15, 16 bucks. You can look out for a brand called 3D Solutech that I print with tons. And let me tell you, cheap filaments aren't gonna print that much worse. The reason why cheap filaments exist is because sometimes these rolls, they have a little bit of inconsistency in them. Whether it's inconsistency in uh, the width uh, or the thickness of the filament, whether you know it fluctuates between uh, 1.75, 1.76, sometimes more or less. And then also dust, how clean, how clean everything is. Some of them um, could cause clogs potentially. Now, is it that gonna happen often? Probably not. Um, and I always suggest you get a couple super cheap rolls to practice just printing something complex or if you're new to 3D printing, practice using your printer, practice all of your settings, do temperature towers, do cubes, get that thing dialed in. Um, you know, if you're trying to design something, you can use the cheap roll to make iterations uh, for your design. And then after you're done with that, get yourself a nice roll something that you know uh, the company will stand behind and something that will be consistent for you and will give you good results every time. And that's the second part of the question is what's my current uh, uh, favorite filament? And uh, my favorite brand at the moment is uh, Yusu. Yusu filament, they have uh, a giant selection of really cool filaments, sparkle filaments, silk filament, which is what we have here today. PLA, PLA plus, PTG, I suggest you check my links below. Uh, uh, and check this brand out. And I have here two rolls of silk, and I'm gonna unbox them and uh, show you uh, show you how they come and the reason, another reason why I like them other than they just print really, really well. So let's see. Here's what it looks like in the box. You get a nice thank you, and you get a uh, slip showing you what to do if uh, you liked the uh, product or if you had problems with the product. It's nice to know that they'll stand behind you right out of the box here. Shows you where to go, who to contact, and what to do. Pretty cool. Another thing is there's a little extra with a nozzle, a 0.4 millimeter nozzle. Really nice, especially if you have an Ender style uh, printer. That's awesome. All right, and here's the roll. This one is their Silk Silver Pearlescent. So it has this awesome shine to it. It almost looks metallic when you print this. It literally looks like a, a brushed aluminum uh, type texture to it. So one of the notable things is their packaging. It's reusable. I know other filament uh, companies have this, but all this is encompassing why this thing, why I suggest this brand for, their, for your nice filament roll. Reusable bag, uh, quality, large, uh, desiccant, uh, um, uh, right in the roll over here, keeping the filament uh, moisture free and also this the roll itself oftentimes when you get cheap filaments you get a black spool sometimes you get a window sometimes you don't get anything so once you get towards the end there you kind of have to guess how much filament you have here you can see right through the roll all the way through very nice you can tell how nicely wound that is it's just no nonsense I know that when I put this in my printer it's gonna print great and the little bonus in the box is just um, icing on the cake, you know? All right, second roll. Same thing, got your nozzle. This one has a uh, needle in case you have any clogs. Very nice to get little extras in your box. Look at this color, guys. This is the silk bronze. I mean, that is just a beautiful color. Can you see that shimmering, shimmering gleam right on the roll? Look at that nicely wound spool. 
I'm really excited to get printing with these things. If you guys have any questions for me or want to see more examples of the stuff, uh, I'm going to make a follow-up video to show you how they came out. But follow me on Instagram if you want to see progress. I post in my stories if I'm working on something. And I make posts once I'm usually finished some little project that I'm working on something I want to share. Um, feel free to comment below. If you guys have any suggestions, help other people out that are in the video. Feel free to uh, give your two cents down in the comments below. Let's talk about it. But to summarize everything, Yusu is my current uh, favorite brand of filament. And for my cheap filament, I suggest 3D, 3D Solutech or something along those lines. Brands don't necessarily matter once you're looking at the cheap filament. Because like I said, this stuff is just going to be superior when you're doing print to print to print. I bet you out of 10 prints, that cheap filament is going to fail twice, maybe three times. This stuff is just going to keep delivering. Um, all right, guys. I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.